Where does time come from? It's a question that feels almost too vast to answer, like asking, what's the meaning of life? Or why is there a G in love lasagna? Time governs our days, our decisions, and even our sense of self. It's why you're not still wearing diapers and considering 3 p.m. a suitable bedtime. But what if time as we know it doesn't really exist? What if it's not fundamental to the universe, but something that emerges, like a shadow cast by a deeper hidden reality, or perhaps like that strange smell in your fridge that defies identification? In 2024, physicists, bless their insatiable curiosity, are tackling this mind-bending question. They're plunging into the strange world of quantum mechanics, a realm where the usual rules of reality seem to dissolve and challenging everything we think we know about time. Here's the kicker. It's not just that time is mysterious. It might not even be real. Imagine finding out Santa Claus isn't real. Now replace Santa with the entire fabric of your perceived reality. In classical physics, time is like a flowing river, steady, constant, and forever moving forward, no matter what happens. It's a bit like that one relative at Thanksgiving who talks endlessly, oblivious to whether anyone is listening. But then Einstein, ever the disruptor, turned this notion upside down with his theory of general relativity. Time, he argued, isn't separate from space. Together, they form a malleable fabric called space-time. And this space-time bends and warps under the influence of gravity and motion, like a cheap mattress sagging beneath a particularly heavy bowling ball. Zoom into the quantum scale, though, and things get downright bizarre. Here, the idea of time unravels faster than a politician's promise. Particles don't carry tiny clocks. They exist in a blur of probabilities, transitioning between states in ways that defy ordinary notions of time. It's as though they're perpetually late for an appointment they don't even remember making. Enter the Wheeler-DeWitt equation, a mathematical attempt to describe the universe in quantum terms. Surprisingly, time doesn't appear in this equation at all. That's right, one of the most fundamental equations of physics skips time entirely. It's like baking a cake and forgetting the flour. Sure, you might end up with something, but it's definitely not cake. It's as if the universe said, time, nah, I'm good. So what does this mean? At the most fundamental level, the universe might be timeless. No ticking clock, no past, no future. Just a wave function, a mathematical fog containing all possible states of the universe simultaneously. Essentially, it's a cosmic choose-your-own-adventure story where all the endings exist at once. If the universe is timeless, why does time feel like it flows, especially on Monday mornings? Physicists have a few theories, although they're, they're as clear as mud. One idea suggests that, that time is relational. It emerges from observing changes in the relationships between objects. A clock ticking isn't time itself. It's just a way to measure changes relative to something else, like measuring your age against the lifespan of a fruit fly. Another theory links time to entropy, the measure of disorder in a system. The second law of thermodynamics dictates that entropy always increases, which is why coffee cools down, eggs can't be unbroken, and embarrassing moments at office parties can't be unseen. This increase in entropy might explain the arrow of time, the sense that time moves forward. Unless, of course, you're Benjamin Button, in which case, congratulations on your reverse aging. But here's the twist. In quantum mechanics, particles don't always follow this one-way rule. They can behave as if they're moving forward or backward in time, depending on how they're observed. It's like the universe is playing a game of temporal ping pong, leaving us as bewildered spectators. Some researchers speculate that time might uh, emerge from quantum entanglement. When two particles are entangled, their states remain connected, no matter the distance between them. It's like a long distance relationship, but instead of awkward video calls, there's instantaneous quantum communication. This entanglement could generate a kind of proto-time, a rudimentary sense of progression when observed collectively. Perhaps time is just a cosmic group chat gone wild. So is time real, or is it an illusion? A tool we've devised to navigate a timeless universe? A conspiracy hatched by the watchmaking industry, perhaps? The implications are staggering. If time isn't fundamental, concepts like causality, cause and effect, might need rethinking. If there's no true before can A really cause B, did the universe even have a beginning, or will it sim simply fade away like a poorly conceived 80s rock ballad? 
Physicists are testing these ideas through quantum simulations, entropy studies, and explorations into space-time's building blocks. It's cutting-edge science with deeply philosophical ramifications. Um, it challenges not only our understanding of the universe, but our place within it. Enough to make you want to crawl under the covers and rethink everything. Maybe time isn't something the universe hands us. Maybe it's a construct we create, like a cosmic GPS recalculating to guide us through a much stranger reality. By uncovering how time emerges, we might unlock deeper truths about existence, or just end up more perplexed than ever. What do you think? Is time real, or is it all in our heads? Or is our head just a figment of a timeless universe's imagination? Share your thoughts, preferably before the heat death of the universe.